Okay. Welcome back. So, uh, I'm gonna enslave. It's gonna increase population all around. So, enslave. All right. You know the same deal. I look at what they have. I didn't know Heroes Hall worked for me. I find the ones that do that. Minus 25% happiness. I'm gonna look at this. It's at 90 public order, which is incredibly high considering. Um, the Vernos. Now it's at 100. That's a whole 10%. So, as you can see, it pays to look at your cities. Not just leave them to their own devices, because eventually they will, like, what you do will come back to bite you. Oh well, I don't have any money. I'm going to not retrain that one unit. Why can't I retrain you? Oh, insufficient, didn't I? Right. Okay, um, there we go, because I need those walls. <laughs> Let's just be realistic. I need those walls. While the Gaul probably won't try to take it, the, um, they might. This Dacian people. So, uh, let's go. Um. Alright, this is still the same turn, isn't it? Yeah. In my turn. I was wondering, like, why am I so short on money? Another siege. I'm gonna call it, call it a bluff. Not only am I not sallying out, I'm not gonna destroy the army, which disadvantages me. But since when have I not bothered to be disadvantaged? Uh, let's see. Got one agent. Oop. At your service. Counter. At your service. I heard that. Alright, now then, when you finish, you finish. Settlement besieged, sir. Factions, someone got something legio I think someone has more banners than they need to. Either way, we're going to assault this place. Now again, boiling oil. But no, not that. Again, this they have very minimal soldiers right now. Note, right now. Eventually they will <laughs> have more. Let's go, maintain siege. Actually, what soldiers are here? Numidian skirmishers. Okay, look. 7 melee, 24 missile, 23 defense. And look at mine. 6 melee, 23 missile, 22 defense. So, it's a minimal gain. But experience it's equal and yet this unit actually no with equal units it's equal experience okay never mind here I'm gonna keep this one. but also I should get it because it has bonus to woods and desert and basically Africa is desert <laughs> now this one has a considerably higher melee it's very good in melee I think this one's only good in deserts but again wow not in this area because it's closer to the coast so it's gonna be greener one of the cities I gotta take is actually desert actually a couple are in desert regions and I just love that city it's called lol that's a historic city it's that naming apps I think it's IOI or something like that it's not actually lol it just looks like it just like over here people will find it funny because there was actual island over here I believe this map is probably not the best one to base it off of, but it was called the Island of Lesbo. Some the men on the island were lesbians, and it was actual historic city. I don't feel like explaining all of it, but just know historical city. It was named that because of a poet from the island who might have been gay. But you know, shoulda woulda. Ooh, I should get some elephants just to like show the like how you like me now. Yeah, let's see how you like it when elephants are charging at your soldiers. Uh, I never get these militia units. And, ooh. Now, just in general, I think their units are better. <laughs> Look at that. They're even better in melee. Although they have five experience. So, I could take that into consideration. But there's also 160 of them. Superior. Yeah. Although they frighten infantry. So, I don't know. I'll, I'll, like, 
In this case, I think I'll determine it based off of what I lose in the combat there. I'm wasting too much time on that spot. Um, let's continue onward. I now need to figure out, let's see. Oops, no, not that. Uh, which is it? Surely scroll. Settlements. Oh, okay, it does show. I thought it had a little symbol here saying it's constructing something. So let's go to Catala. Our capital! Our loyal capital! Uh. Provincial barracks. Do I want one yet? No. Actually, I don't. I do, do not want that much money spent. I really just can't sit there and just spend that kind of money on people. It's not worth it. Now, this will increase the law. But, again, don't need it. So, we're gonna. Okay, you have something. Uh, we're gonna ignore it for right now. Look at these roads, man. They're so sexy. In certain regions, others, they, they just are not sexy. They're the opposite of sexy. Which I guess makes ugly. Okay, shipwright. Um. And what else do we need? This place, I even it's just the most random road. All right, I can't really make much for you except an arena, or something. But I kind of am desperate. I need to make these people happy. So <laughs> it's gonna that's gonna be a partial drain on my economy. But I mean, I'm pretty sure we'll make it. I mean, we always make it. Shipwright. Lots and lots of trade. Uh, another cunning guy with. A single soldier in his army. Okay. That is not right. But I will eliminate him. It's just us and the cat. So. Ooh, and he's a good guy. He's relatively good in combat. And he's young? Oh, no, he's 60. Um, attempt a night attack to give myself an advantage. And, uh, see you... On the battle map, I guess. I guess you want to see this fight epic. <sighs> What has that feels good. I just drank some water. So, cavalry. Cavalry. This is actually rather awkward too because I'm trying to play and I my pinky messed up badly. I don't need any of this. Let's go, man. No, I don't want it to pop up at all. There we go. No. <laughs> have to say you're still gonna have some kind of organization here so here he is um i think the only disadvantage i found about this is you have to know the actual high key to fast forward i don't know it offhand so i can't do it <laughs> here's the high keys but i don't feel like looking through the instructions i think it's page up or not <laughs> is it the plus button wait what oh crap that thin my that extended my lines i forgot that button like makes it so the lines are able to be thinner or wider depending on how you like it although I shouldn't be attacking from the bottom of it I'm gonna take the advantage yes we're gonna minimize casualties wait are you firing it will no skirmishing but so remember Will is right there. Wait, no. I'm gonna show you Will. He looked at his horse's butt. Him. Right there. That's Will. That's their general name something. But Will is right there. So you gotta kill him before you even think about killing anyone else. <coughs> so anyway. Uh, I wish I could fast forward. Like I said, I don't remember the hotkey. You know what? I'll look at the hotkeys. Uh, let's see free movement uh oh here it is oh i don't have it bound oh oh well <laughs> yeah okay so we're just not gonna be able to fast forward so we're gonna use my equivalent double dive let's go run my pretties run okay that was weird Run, my pretties! Run, my pretties! To the east! Well, to our left! 
Because technically that's west. Where the moon is, I think. I think that's west. Wait, I'm not sure. That might be east. What the? Okay, I'm editing this out, probably. <laughs> uh, he ran off the fail. I didn't see that. I missed all. Okay, um, sorry about that. Um, the game crashed. Like, fraps crap. Something weird happened, I'm not sure. Um, what happened was, like, fraps crashed, and in the process, it caused Grown Total War to have a runtime error. And it, as I ended the battle that you saw, it kept registering me as still part of that battle, but at the same time, I was trying to load this map. It was, it was, something weird happened, man. I just don't know. Not sure anymore, man. But anyway, so I hadn't saved, as you saw. So I just went back and did everything, basically. Uh, and I actually went ahead a little bit and oh, skipped to the part me. where I got the general on the island. Um, one thing that happened differently, and you might want to take note of that, the Greeks actually sent a navy, an uh, army here. Like, he docked. Right, like there's one. That's one army over there. Here's two. And I think Macedon's on their way with one. I don't know. Okay, but literally, he docked right there, right next to the city. Then he went back onto the boat. So because of this, now I'm building. <laughs> now I'm going to be building walls on the coastal cities. I didn't see that coming. And for valid reasons, I've played to 200 BC without ever being attacked like that. Like normally. It's normally I like play to that point, but then because I said I wanted to do it as a let's play I wanted to stop so that way I didn't get to like having to fight these guys I wanted it to be a new experience fighting them And stuff like that and I knew if I'd have kept playing beyond 200 I would have kept playing the game so anyway uh, we, we have a siege going uh, the city thanks to this the script thing obviously gave it a garrison so it's a simple, simple, okay, it gave him a general, I guess, too? I don't know what happened there. I don't know if he was there the whole time. Uh, but, you see, they got, what, six units of archers? <laughs> uh, four units of Libyan spears, four of Poeni, four skirmishers, uh, four skirmishers. And, yeah, so they are missile heavy, and I have no Testudo, <laughs> no none of that. Town, shoot, urban cohorts right now would be perfect. I could just literally